everybody! I'm a new reaction to Love Victor, season 3, episode number 4. You up? I'm so excited to do reaction to episode number 4. I really like episode number 3. It was really, really juicy. We have like the little feud or conflict between Raheem and Benji, and then Victor meeting this new guy named Nick. This episode title is called You Up, so I don't know. I can tell you this has to do with Victor. I don't know if he's talking to Nick or maybe somehow he's talking to Benji. I don't know. As usual, there's going to be some possible spoilers up ahead. So, let's do this and hope you enjoy my reaction. Yeah, So excited! Oh shit. Aww. Yeah, that's the episode title. Oh snap! Oh shit! Oh! Okay, I, I was wondering, would you want to maybe catch a movie here or something? Oh! Oh, um, like a like a like a date. Aww. Uh, I, I didn't think that's what we were doing here. To be honest, I'm not not really looking for a relationship right now. Uh oh! Oh, oh shit! Hanging out with multiple people. Uh oh. Yeah. You are just the prettiest girls in all of Even in that lumpy old sweater. Oh. Can I help you? Why am I spending the afternoon shopping with your mother? Please, I just I can't do another one of these shopping days where she criticizes everything about me and asks me Aww. endless questions about which boys I'm dating. Yeah, that does sound awkward. When are you going to tell her about your Lucy situation? Oh. My general policy is never, ever tell her anything ever. Quick question. So, you know how I'm in peer tutoring? Well, Benji fell behind in rehab, and of all the people in this school, he was assigned me. Mm hmm. Is that weird for you? No, no, you, you should definitely help him. Oh, man. Oh, shit. Hey, you're, uh, you helping me? It's usually the other way around. Well, I was in the mood for some fun. Who are you? <laughs> Just call me Mr. Casual. Oh shit. Oh shit. Sorry, sorry. Should I pull it off? Just pull my pants off. Oh shit. Studying. Oh. I'm a fool soldier. You love it. I really do. <laughs> okay, bye. Do friends cup each other's faces? You are so Mushing me, what is this? <laughs> Sloppy lag doing it to Felix in the hallway. Oh, probably has something on his cheek. He's a very messy eater. She has been acting kind of strange lately. Mm -hmm. Like, happy. Yes, like the other day she said I love you and then didn't ask me for money after. Oh. You know what she said to me? Good morning. Oh. Should I be worried about Lake? Why? Oh uh, shit. I think so. I, I think everything's fine. Why do you ask? She's been so cagey with me lately. I mean, even more than normal. You don't need to worry. Lake has been super happy lately. It was not close with my mom growing up. I mean, she already raised four kids by the time I showed up. It was a drunken mistake. If I ever had a daughter, we'd be best friends. And here I am asking you about Lake's life because she doesn't want to have anything to do with me. Aww. She is so lucky to have a friend like you, Mia. Bought us some fresh baked pastries to signify our fresh day start. Aww. Can I just say one more thing? There are only three other gay guys in this whole school. The one that we know of, right? Sophomore Matthew really sets off my door. All I'm saying is, shouldn't we at least try to get along? Mm hmm. When I told Victor that I was tutoring you. Wait, wait, wait. You, you told Victor. I'm oh, like, shit. I didn't know it was a secret. No, it's, it's not a secret. It's a secret. See Nick last night? Oh shit! Oh, tell me everything. <laughs> Why are you so invested in this? Cool. Oh, okay, first of all, c congratulations on what you're packing, but that is a mean wang. Stop looking! Well, okay, I can't. It's like a car accident. But it, it, it's, it's only a little rash. It's probably also sexually transmitted to oh. what happens. Oh, oh shit! What do I do? She kept talking about how she wanted you to be there. I think she really wishes you guys were closer. Yeah. Well. 
She also wishes Harry Styles was 10 years older. That's <laughs> not the obstacle. Underneath it all, she really does love you. Aww. Maybe you should tell her about Lucy? Mm-hmm. I think she'd be supportive. She's home. Okay, we're gonna have a nice, calm talk like we discussed, right? Oh, shit. Right. Hello, wonderful parents. Adrian, go to your room. We need to talk to your sister. I always miss the juicy stuff. <laughs> What's going on between you and Felix? Oh, shit. We're together. Mm-hmm. This is exactly why I didn't tell you. Oh. Well, anytime I date someone, dad goes crazy. Oh, you think this is crazy? Oh, no. You don't even know crazy. Uh -oh. Remember when I started dating Eric and you showed him your knife collection? What about Ruby Diaz, hmm? He held my hand at my fifth grade roller skating party. You pulled him aside and whatever you said to him made him pee his pants. No, 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 you don't get to yell at me. You're the one in trouble. Now go to your room. I'm not a child. Go! Oh, shit. Okay, Benji. So here's what we're gonna do. You're gonna look at the problem and tell me what is the limit. Please don't talk to me like I'm five years old. <laughs> What's the limit, dumbass? He's visiting from Iran, and he's super religious, and doesn't even believe that gay people exist. Aww. So while he's staying at the house, my parents asked me if I could go back in the closet. Oh, shit. I'm trying to be really cool about it, since they were so great about me coming out. But Aww. if he tells people back in Iran, it'll be like this huge, dark stain on my family. Aww. And now I'm wearing the fruitiest shirt in my closet and he's gonna be here in 20 minutes. I think I can help. Oh shit. Can you help. It's poison ivy. Oh. Which I probably got from walking up a dick in his backyard. Mm hmm Okay. If I was still with Benji, none of this would happen. Oh shit. Even if it did, like we would have gone through it together. I'm sorry for uh, pressuring you to talk to your mom about Lucy. I'm always on your side. Aww. So much easier if I could just tell her about Lucy, but the more I like something, the more she criticizes it. Oh, don't say that. You'd be surprised what you can find in the lost and found. Go? No, never. I'd rather watch baseball. <laughs> Sorry for being a jerk. Aww. About the tutoring. I just feel like I'm disappointing everybody. No, don't say that. <laughs> You're trying to look straight. It's perfect. Taking his shirt off. First big turn now, me. Take our daughter's door off the hinges. No. Pilar has a point. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. When it comes to dating, you do tend to fly off the handle, and I know that it comes from a good place, but it's it's, it's a lot. <laughs> she isn't a little girl. Mm hmm. Pilar is growing up. We should be thankful that it's Felix. He's, he's <laughs> sweet, he's Aww. smart. He's you like Felix. Pilar, come on out! It brought to my attention that I could have handled this differently. You think? Felix wanted to tell you guys a million times. I made him keep it a secret because I didn't want you to scare him off. Aww. But it's real. We love each other. We're okay. Aww. No more secrets. Guys, this is my fault. Aww. Okay, and I, I, I want to let you know, I have grounded myself. And so any chore you need me to pick up, <laughs> thanks to Felix, I'm sure they're on board. Aww. Really? Aww. Oh, guys, bring it in. <laughs> I'm from La Salazar. Oh, Aww. I love oh. Felix. Uh, hey Nick, it's Victor, um, I just thought it'd be better to call rather than text. I want something more than mm -hmm. text. I want someone who answers my calls. Aww. And I, I know you've been super clear about keeping this casual, which is totally cool for you. It's just, um, it's not really working for me. Don't slouch, you're gonna wind up with a turtle body. <laughs> Mom, why do you criticize everything about me? Oh. What? My weight, my clothes, the way that I 
sit in this chair. This morning you corrected my pronunciation of the word croissant. You're never happy, no matter what I do. Aww. I am so sorry. I had no idea. Aww. And I just thought maybe I could help you present your best self to the world and Aww. you could avoid that kind of bullying. Aww. I think you are perfection. Oh. You're smart and beautiful and any boy would be so lucky to have you. Oh shit. Actually, Mom, you know my friend, Lucy? Mm-hmm. She's not just my friend. Yeah. We're together. Aww. Are you bi? I actually don't know yet. Aww. Are you okay? Of course I'm okay. Aww. <laughs> oh, wait. This is actually so exciting because this is perfect for your college essays. Finally, something that makes you interesting. Okay, well, you're doing it again. <laughs> it's going to take me a minute to unlearn. Oh, shit. How'd it go? See for yourself. Aww. Let's go, go. What's the house down a minus? Careful. Oh. Your hair. Oh, shit. Oh shit! Oh shit! Wow, that was a really, really good episode. It was kind of really touching with like Blake and her mom. I wasn't sure really what to expect when it came to those two. Oh, it's so adorable. And then Raheem and Benji, they're. Getting along, which is so nice. I think they'll have a good friendship. I don't think they'll end up together. I don't think they will. And then with like Victor and Nick. Well, at least Victor didn't get like STDs or anything. Because that was my fear. When like Victor probably had like a rash or something. But whew, it was only poison ivy. And he has like a dating app. It should be interesting now. Yeah. So now we're actually at the halfway mark. There's only four more episodes left of the season and the series. Oh, I don't want the series to end because it's such a great show. I hope you enjoyed my reaction. If you like watching reaction videos, make sure you subscribe. If you enjoyed my reaction, make sure you give a thumbs up. And a comment down below when you follow the episode.